Hello, welcome back. Today, we're going to be checking out a game called April 24th, which um, it is uh, the 25th. My bad. I meant to play this game yesterday, but I um, kind of forgot it was coming out. My bad. But this game is a part of the Emika Games Collective, I believe. It's, I'm pretty sure it's a bunch of different devs kind of compacted into one big dev type thing they made september 7th and summer 58 which are also up on this channel and i have yet to go through all of their other games which i really want to because i know they're fucking great so without further ado let's get into this on april 24th you play as an experienced journalist who always strives to uncover the truth he manages to gain access to the house which is guarded by the police in connection with the terrible incident in the house, the main character discovers VHS recordings. The tapes capture the moments of events related to that fateful night and what happened afterwards. Gradually, watching the tapes, he begins to realize that he's being watched, and the consequences after viewing will be irreversible. Immerse yourself in the atmosphere of the house through VHS recordings. Every frame, every sound will drive you crazy and endanger the life of anyone who decides to watch them. Chapter 1, The Wicked Oh fuck Alrighty, we got a lighter And a hanging of Jesus Yes, I said a hanging of Jesus Wow, there's a lot of fucking ambience already So, how exactly did we get in this house? We're an investigator Or like a journalist That's creepy as fuck. Oh, you motherfucker. I hate balls. <laughs> no, just a lone ball falling down the stairs. Freaky as fuck. Oh, motherfucker. <laughs> Alright, they got the sounds down. He wants me in the basement still. That has been made very apparent. We are already starting out strong though. Um, hi. She shouldn't have done that in your bed. She pissing it. She deserves to be punished. Hey, yo. Dear Ben, you've been living in the basement for months and haven't come out. You're going crazy and dragging us along. The kids and I don't understand what's going on with you. You've become aggressive and you're taking out all your anger on us. Alice is sick. It's hard for her to live in such an environment. And Jacob is still too young. And I don't want him to get hurt. Know that we have the right to live without you. I tried to discuss everything with you in a normal setting. But you don't make contact. I just want you to know that we have someone who will take care of all of us. All you have to do is let us go. Let us do this. Sincerely, Evelyn. Well, shit. Chapter 2, April 24th, 1991. Oh, fuck. What I was saying though is I'm very glad that uh, it gave us um, time to actually read that out loud. A lot of the games haven't been. What are these chains dragging? No. Why do you want me to go that way? What if I want to go behind you? This guy's like the, the fucking Babadook. We're finally upstairs. We 
We have some spaghetti. Some spaghetti and meatball. Delicious. Nice little fireplace. This is a nice ass home. Do it. Okay, Emperor Palpatine. Do it. What do you want me to do? God, it's terrifying children. Fucking terrifying. Grandma? Why? You don't need to do this. You do not need to pop up unannounced. You can announce your presence. My name is Sean Miller. I'm conducting a journalistic investigation of a brutal murder on the outskirts of the city that occurred on April 24th. I want to find out the true cause of this crime and find answers to all questions. Chapter 3, Observer. We are the Observer. So, all right, now we're playing as the main character. This looks very different. Okay, so we were playing as the murderer before. I got you now, I got you now. We're caught up to speed. No, um, what the hell do I do? Can't go out that door. On April 24th, a brutal murder took place in a house on the outskirts of the city. A man killed his entire family with an axe. The accused himself called the police and was arrested on the spot. The man testifies and says that he was influenced by a certain man in a hat and that he for was forced to commit this crime. The police have no further comment. We will monitor developments in this case. So it, it really do be the Babadook. Fucking phenomenal movie, by the way. If you haven't watched it, please go do so. This game is very fucking atmospheric. All the noises and sounds. Pieces of me. We had a new tape. Would have fucking ran. Chapter four pieces of me. No, oh, why are we tying the cross to the door? What nice pictures. The fuck was that? This is some, some nice decor you got going on here. Who's your interior designer? Need to look for a knife. 
That's not creepy at all. <laughs> hey, yo, that is fucked. <laughs> now we gotta look for a knife. Now where the fuck is it? I don't know about you, but uh, I keep my knives in the kitchen. Oh, maybe if I looked up. Out of here. I don't want to. Actually, I do. I lied. I want to get the fuck out of here. The VHS aesthetic. Jesus, we're saved. What the fuck? I want to kick it. <laughs> I don't want to look to my right. Fuck, we're dead. Hey, knock it off in there. Kids are breaking shit. We need a key now. We have to look for a key. Or a crowbar, that works too. Okay. Alright, I got you. I see you, I recognize your struggles. If you see a cat on my head, no you don't. Alright, what can we open with this crowbar now though? I would have imagined we could open that lock, but for whatever reason, that didn't want to work. Oh, we can go back down the stairs. Fuck off. I don't like that. Oh, the cross inverted. Hey, yo. Oh, why would we open that after seeing that? I would be fucking gone. Kidding, face your fears. <sighs> she has disappeared. We did find a key. She's gonna be behind us now. Huh? Wait, so. No, fuck. Now we can open this door. Ah, uh, I ain't fucking with this. Yeah, no. I 
to go home. Is this a grocery list? Also, I ain't fucking with that door opening. I would imagine that's gonna be in the basement, right? Yeah, we're gonna have to find the rope and shit. Yeah, I know. I'm aware. No fuck. Looking straight into darkness down a set of stairs is probably one of the most fucking uneasy feelings one could ever have. Hi. You just you just stay there, okay? Told you to stay put. <laughs> what the fuck am I supposed to do with the rope and shit now though? God, do I have to go back up? <laughs> you motherfucker. Oh, you motherfucker, too. Wait, no, you're the same person. to the doors. <laughs> Close and board up the coffin. Yeah, all of the, uh, all the other games of theirs have been super jump scare heavy, but this one's definitely a lot more. Go to bed. Need to find a cross and put it on the coffin. There was one right here. You have hit it. You have hidden it. I 
Are we like performing some kind of ritual or what's going on here? Where the fuck did the cross go? And there's a bookshelf out in the living room. But I don't know how we can get to the living room right now. We can't. If I was Jesus, where would I be? Oh wait, the bookshelf's here. What did that unlock? Did that unlock the safe? There's no way that's even logically possible. You fucking pussy ass bitch. Oh, hello. <laughs> A child. So, oh, chapter five, the touch of evil. Is that like our sleep paralysis it alarm waking us up? Marine capsule. By my calculations, we should get the fuck out of here. Need to lock the door with the chair. No, you need to leave. Oh, fuck. <laughs> it's too late. Proof of death. Never mind, we're too far in it now. We are too far gone. Our life is this investigation now. Chapter 6, Proof of Death. Oh, fuck. We're now at April 28th. Damn. These rats spend no fucking time. Start come munching on the decomposition. Battle until death. Jesus, there's blood fucking everywhere. So why are we like locked in here? There's a saw over here. What the fuck? We start hacking away. Two things. That is one very fucking sharp saw. And no. Two. Why is that fucking baby just waddling around? <laughs> and he waddled away. You waddle, waddle. I need a key. You didn't need a key for the last one. You can open this door with a bolt cutter. Let's go get one. Do we 
carry the cross around to keep us safe too. Need to find the password. We probably gotta go back upstairs, right? But it seems how this game is being played out. Oh, three. Three C. Now we gotta look for letters and numbers. You stop right now. Right now. Missing the first digit. Oh, A. It's a four three three five. Get the fuck out of here. Why would that open this and not the door? Dear Ben, I can't live like this anymore. I want to get a divorce and sell the house. My torment has become unbearable, and I need freedom. Please give me the opportunity to start a new chapter in my life. Sincerely, Evelyn. He was not happy about this. That's fucked. Oh. Hi, Ben. I'm assuming. Don't mind if I take this. Fucker. Me and Ben don't go way back. He just likes things in his mouth. You do have fun. like this. I think I looked away when it was supposed to scare me. Fuck. That's disappointing. But also saved. There's something behind the door. I need to find something to open it with. No, man, this is fucked. Jesus, these fucking rats, though. Nasty as fuck. Oh, there's bolt cutters. Uh, 
Hey yo. The old sheet. The old sheet ghost. Alright, let's go open this shit up now. The old crowbar. Hello. Nope, I'm not looking back. <laughs> Found the axe. seeing you here. You motherfucker. Go away, you bitch. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, are we just in a, in a daze? Are we in a trance? What the fuck? Chapter 7, there is no way out. What the fuck? Don't want to look behind me. Still the same. Still the same note. Oh, we have a new tape. There is no way out. It's your turn to make a movie. Hey, yo. What kind of movie are we making? Why are you? Why are, why are you here? <laughs> we got our handy dandy crowbar now. I'm gonna go fuck some shit up. One of these is going to be a fucking scare. Oh, a noose. Oh, no, right? Where'd the TV go? Settle down. Oh, fuck. Hello. Yeah, 
You know, that really is a face only a mother could love. What am I supposed to do? I'm supposed to do something, but I don't know what it is. investigation but unfortunately i will not be able to publish it this house is a source of madness it has consumed me i wanted to find the truth but instead i found death it's all about the man in the hat he oppresses his victims and makes them do terrible things i can't resist him sean miller what the fuck what the fuck is happening right now are we gonna hang with the boys Just hanging out. Alrighty then. What a way to end it. Literal literally. Oh shit. Settle down. Is this the end? I don't fucking know, is it? What the fuck? Well, alright. Oh. And the title screen just keeps fucking ch- Okay. Wow. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, that was interesting. Um, I did enjoy it. That was, that was pretty fucking good, actually. Um, like I said, I, I have played, uh, previous, um, games from, I think, even nobody specifically. So, uh, just in, in the other ones that I played of this collective, this has been fucking night and day. September 7th was really, really good. Uh, Summer of 58 was also good, but definitely could tell it's, it's earlier in their development career. So it's, really cool seeing this kind of evolve over time that was that was good this one was very jump scare heavy um i will say almost to the point of too much because towards the end there they were they were kind of just like oh that happened oh that happened the first one though was really fucking good it was very well placed wasn't expecting it to just be out of the gate start so it completely caught me off guard and I enjoy shit like that. But overall, super like dark premise and it was it was dark, it was gory, it was it was pretty much all that you could ask for in a in the horror game and experience. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on it. And if you enjoyed me or this style of content, please consider subscribing. It's free. Uh, also if you have any other horror game suggestions, please let me know down in the comments. As I am always open to expanding my never-ending list of horror games that I have to play on this channel. So stick around, because it's going to be a fucking ride. But I do really hope you enjoyed, and until next time, bye.